through her life she teaches that seeking the will of god and doing the will of god is important Dear brothers and sisters in Jesus Christ we are in the Tuesday of the second week of Advent and today the church celebrates the feast of our lady of Guadalupe and today we reflect on the gospel of St Luke chapter 1 verses 26 to 38 in today's gospel the angel Gabriel visits blessed virgin Mary and announces the birth of jesus with little hesitation blessed virgin mary questions the angel then she completely surrender herself to the will of god and from that moment onwards she was completely doing the will of god in her life bringing the child jesus to this world and participation in his ministry in every aspect her motive is to do the will of god and in the world we can see different places blessed virgin mary appeared and every place she draws people towards jesus she never draws people to herself for her glory instead she draws people to jesus and invite them to do the will of god to obey jesus to follow him so as a mother she try to do the will of god the will of jesus and she invites us to follow him through him to the eternity so when she appeared in gaurlape she invites the people to the conversion she invites people to follow jesus and she asks to build a church there so that people may come back to jesus people may know jesus through her humility mary teaches to be humble and open to god's will she reminds us that true greatness comes from serving others rather than seeking self importance through her life she teaches that seeking the will of god and doing the will of god is important god raises the lowly from her experience she know that when we humble ourselves god exalt us and she is an example of compassion mary's love for her children is boundless she intercedes for us before god and others comfort in their so- suffering so through the compassionate love mary draws each one of us to god. and she intercedes for for us because she want each one of us to be with the lord and again her faith her faith allow her to surrender herself to the will of god and she invites us to have that faith to trust in the lord whatever be our life situation put our trust in the lord and hold on to him so that we will see his presence and his guidance and at the end the salvation that he offered for us blessed virgin mary through every apparition gives us an example how to live the life in this world how to follow the lord and how to manifest him in our day to day lives yes my dear friends as we celebrate the feast of our lady of guadalupe let us hold on to her hand 
and walk towards Jesus and his glory. Amen.